Hey, it's Angie with News OK. I am here at the Oklahoma City Museum of Art for the new exhibit called Herb Ritz Beauty and Celebrity. All photographs, a lot of celebrities are involved in this. Um, beautiful photographs. And I'm here with Jennifer who can tell us all about this exhibit. Yes, this is an amazing look at Herb Ritz, who is a famous American photographer from the 1980s and 90s. And he captured the energy and natural light of Southern California. And what this exhibition entails are over 80 photographs of well-known figures, noted celebrities in film, fashion, politics, uh, music, um, the full range of society. But you'll also see a wide variety variety of his career and the depth of his career. How oh, cool. Yeah, obviously uh, a lot of famous celebrities, but like you said, models as well. So you may not recognize their faces, but it's beautiful. I mean, absolutely gorgeous photos. Yes, her Brits focused on the human body and he was able to capture the human body in, a, in various angles and poses and these compositions of the photographs really enhance um, not only the beauty of the body but it's seen through natural light, the, the emphasis of texture and uh, the wide variety of a natural landscape whether it was water or he when he was photographing on the beach or on the roof terrace of his studio which was based in Hollywood. Nice. Oh how beautiful. Yeah so lots of different Different scenes you can see some of the famous faces behind us um, which is very cool you know some of these celebrities have passed on some of them are still current I mean it's just it's great it's it's very fun well we have um key people that you will recognize, such as Richard Gere, and that was one of the earliest photographs in Herb Ritz's career, um, but also spanning to artists such as Dale Chihuly, um, which is very important to the Oklahoma City Museum of Art. Um, also artists Louise Bourgeois and Francesco Clemente, but also movie stars such as Johnny Depp, Matthew McConaughey, and of course Madonna, and Madonna's True Blue album cover, um, photographed in her famous side profile, and and really became an iconic image that really helped shape that album and shape her career. Another unique part of the exhibition is Herb Ritz's Africa series. And Herb Ritz traveled to Africa in 1993 and photographed the Maasai tribe. And it's really a true look of the beauty that he was able to capture through those photographs, unassociated with fame and fashion of what he was, uh, pre his predominant work in California, but really a look at uh, nature and the landscape of Africa and the people of Africa and really how he was able to capture such a unique look um, and a sentimental, intimate look at their culture. Yeah, and then tell us about the film. You've got a little film. Film running. We also have included in the exhibition of film um, a, a, an intimate look at Herb Ritz and his career, where you can hear um, interviews from um, from some of the people that um, of whom he photographed, um, as well as um, from the Herb Ritz Foundation, and you will get a real true sense of what it was like to be on one of these photo shoots with Herb Ritz and the true uh, trust that he had. And many of the people, so many people, trusted Herb Ritz on um, in the way that he was able to capture them in their likeness. Very cool. Okay, well, the exhibit is currently open, so you can come down here to the Oklahoma City Museum of Art to check out this wonderful exhibit and obviously the events associated with it. For more information, what's your website? Please visit our website, which is okcmoa.com, and for all of our related programming and events that will be going on throughout the duration of the exhibition. Yes, exactly. Thank you so much. Thank you.